Hi guys, so slightly different video format today, um, if you've been watching to this point, all I've been doing is So, I've literally just cut two 5cm by 10cm cuts, sanded, um, burnt, since what you've been watching, and I've just got a linseed now. So, the two chairs, benches, to go to the baking table, are now done, and they look fab. I am so pleased. I'm going to give them another coat of linseed today, and coat on the underside there as well, but... They're done. And they look awesome. And they are, hopefully, heavy. Quite comfy to sit on. Hey. Yeah. Rubber. Quite sturdy. So yeah, this is part three. I'm done. Um, I am going to out of the last piece. Um, that's already been burnt. I'm going to make some little stools out of the remaining bits of scaffy bags. It'll be about that high. I'm going to cut that into half and make two little, almost foot stooly, foot resting so it'll all fit under the table quite nicely but yeah so I've got the two big ones yeah so I'll do that next week um, but I think this project like mini build is done um, yeah popped to a car boot this morning um, put the price up of admission it used to be 50p it's been 50p for years and it's a pound to get in and it was a bit of a dull day and wasn't the greatest was not the greatest it was like three rows long um, but the big one that I really like over Litchfield starts up in a month's time so I'm hyped for that one and that's free parking um, it'll get better but yeah um, I did pick up some bits not much I got I'm happy with this I bought a load more sanding sheets which are two quid which are alright I thought yeah that's not bad I'd get quite a few and I bought them home and then looked at what size sanding discs I have that's one of mine already and it's like Whoops. They're too small, so I'm going to have to get another pad for them. 
Uh, so it was too quick, but never mind. Um, I did get this. Decided for. There's a guy selling bags of sandpaper of every grit imaginable. There is so much, just off bits of stuff. It's brilliant, amazing. It's like a 25 grit. Down to some really, really super fine. What's that? 800 grit. Just absolutely loads and loads of sandpaper. And that bag was a pound, so I'm hoping for that. Um, I also got that. Um, it's 50p. It's a little dodgy old lady. She's like, yeah, yeah, I'm for steamy grave. And I was like, yeah, I don't know. What I want it for is, you know, these actually make very, very handy. Super tiny disposable. Open. Not disposable. Tiny, tiny little fire plates. So you can have, if you just wanted to go camping, and it was ultra portable. And it was 53. And I thought, why not? And you can get the more expensive ones. But you can kind of adjust it in. And fix it back together. Uh, so I got that. That was good. So that was alright. Got that. And yeah. Um, it's there's a guy who's been selling out of date stock for years, and it does go ridiculously cheap. Last year he was selling like crates of Starbucks festive coffee for like two quid a crate, where it's like two quid for a normal thing. Um, that was more than fifty. Um, they are. Out of date, very out of date in October 2018, so like five months out of date. But, um, that stuff lasts forever, to be fair. But yeah, um, so it's like one pound fifty for how many packs? 20 packs, 30 packs, I don't even know. Um, I don't often eat them because they are really really bad for you, I mean like per 100 grams, 60 grams of fat, 21 grams of saturates, a lot of protein in them um, but yeah better to sit in the cupboard, I'll have them every now and again I do like scratches now and again even though they're not good in my diet um, so yeah, that was that um, final thing is um, I did pop out So I did parts of a range, um, just to pick up some bits, um, I don't need some card, and they did, uh, well we went to two ranges, went one this morning over Canuck to get some card and they had none, um, which was disappointing, and then we went to the other one over Will and Hall, which is the massive one, um, and I've actually got quite a decent range, I was hoping to get from the Canuck one all the stuff that I wanted, I couldn't get it, but we went to the one over and I got some decent, decent bits of camping stuff actually. I got um, water bottle replacement filters uh, were 24p for a pack of two, so I got two lots of so them. Um, I got some um, tent and gear of a solar proof spray, which is Nick Wack stuff, which is brilliant. Um, I was like seven quid, eight quid. Um, but yeah, I need that for doing the canopy for above and for sorting out my tent this year as well. Um, I got um, another little sit mat because I love these little Summit branded sit mats. They're uh, one ninety nine. I got one before. Um, if you saw my little mini video I did not long after my surgery. Um, these are fab. Also, I bought another one for um, wifey. Like two quid, but they're really, really good little sit mats. Um, really recommend them. The nice white clean ones. Lightweight, but quite comfy as well. And the best thing that I got was this, which is uh, Summit branded. So I'm not sure who Summit is branded actually by, if it's their own brand or if it's just the Ranger's own brand. Um, but I've got a little Tiffin cook set. Um, so it comes with it's a six piece set with handle. As you can see, this was £8. Um, it comes with a 1200ml cook pan, 800ml cook pan, cook pan lid, knife with bottle open up fork and a spoon. 
for eight quid, which is not bad for a tiny, tiny little portable set. So let's just give it an open and see what it's like. Um, it is quite lightweight. It's nice and sealed up. Let's see if we can open it. So yeah, what do you think of the benches? I am really, really happy with them. Um, I bet you thought you were going to wait until next week for the next one, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, it's done. I'm really pleased. Um, right, so, let's see. So it opens up like so. This is a little lid, which you could even theoretically use as a little frying pan if you needed to. Um, So that's for large. That's for small. You get a nice, decent size handle, actually. That is a good size handle. I like that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and they're tiny little. <laughs> it's like the smallest spoons ever. <laughs> so tiny. <laughs> but, yeah, for eight quid, you can't really go wrong. Um, and it all sort of clips together rather nicely into a whole little thing. Um, so let's put it there so you can see exactly what you get. So you get, so you get spoon, fork, knife. You get a smaller pan, a bigger pan, and that one. So it's quite useful. So if you're doing you know, out and about, you just want one for boiling water and one for something else. We've got some soup or something like that, you can do it. Um, and again, you could probably use that as a saucepan as well. Um, yeah, so I'd say it's a Summit branded one. Um, it was eight quid. I think it's a really good deal, actually. Um, I'm quite impressed. Uh, yeah, the only thing I haven't been able to get is some solid fuel tabs for the little um, Hexi stove that I got the other week. Never mind. Yes, yeah, so there is the finished bench number one. There is the finished bench number two, and I've just got the rest to do. But yeah, I am super pleased with those. Um, I got asked on Instagram yesterday, it's like, how much does all this cost for you to make all of the things? Um, so, the original cable drum didn't cost me anything, I got that free from my friend um, who delivered it as well, bonus. Um, so the wood didn't actually cost anything, the scaffold plants I got from somebody off Facebook, so that didn't cost anything. Um, the linseed that I used to paint them with yesterday was an old jar of linseed, so that didn't cost anything, although I have bought some today, which cost me five pounds. And um, I did have to buy a canister of the gas for uh, the little blowtorch which cost like four pound from screw fix yesterday so if you go in actual materials as in the wood itself didn't cost anything screws had already got lying about um, all my power tools have got lying about obviously I'm not lying about but yeah um, so really the only things that I've had is consumables for it which is the gas and the thing is it's cost me like nine pound and that's for that bench that bench that's going to be turned into two stools with the scaffold planks and the cable drum itself. Um, the cable drum was paint that we'd already got, so that didn't cost anything either. Um, so yeah, all in all, it's cost £9, which is pretty awesome. Oh, and I suppose, and I bought some. Can I buy sanding discs? Hmm. No, I didn't buy any sanding discs. So yeah, that's it. <coughs> anyway, that's it. Done for the day. I'm going to finish linseeding those. Um, and those but I hope you've enjoyed this I've enjoyed making these it's been fun um, thanks for watching as always do a like your comment subscribe your stuff because I want to get more subscribers I've got a video coming up this week on I don't know if you've noticed but Facebook are stopping live streaming for Android and iOS for people under a thousand subscribers which is like me um, which sucks but I've got to work around so I'm going to post that in the week Anyway, that's me done. 
thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.